House where today state Democrats are calling on Senate members to pass a hate crime bill in this year's legislative session. News 19's Becky Buds was at the state house and has more on whether South Carolina will join the 48 other states who already have hate crimes on the books. On Tuesday, House Democrats asked their fellow Senate members to make South Carolina the 49th state to enact a hate crime law. Call your senators and get them engaged, involved. Because from the last press conference till now, there are hate crimes being committed. Representative Wendell Gilliard has long advocated for this type of bill. This bill is about we the people. H 3620 would toughen penalties on those who commit crimes against a victim because of their race, color, sex, gender, national origin, sexual orientation, or physical or mental disability. The bill would also require a suspect to face a fine up to $10,000 and could be sentenced for up to five more years in prison. Hate crime laws are a way for society to recognize that these crimes strike special fear within the victimized group. The bill is named the Clemente Pinckney Hate Crimes Act in honor of the late state senator and pastor who died when a confessed white supremacist entered a Charleston church in 2015 and killed nine black members of the congregation. Last year, the bill passed in the House with bipartisan support. This year, it faces challenges in the Senate from opponents like Senate Majority Leader Shane Massey. I think one I think our laws are adequate in, in addressing um, criminal behavior in, in this manner. And I think if we look at what's happened, we've had a lot of prosecutions um, related to hate crimes issues, and our laws have stood up. Without bipartisan support in the Senate, the bill is unlikely to pass. If it doesn't make it through this year's session, it will have to be refiled next year. Reporting at the State House, Becky Buds, News 19, WLTX. If the bill is passed, it would then go through a conference committee to work out the differences between the House and Senate versions.